So, I am here at Tony's Cable Car Restaurant waiting on Lynn. She is currently working and after I eat, I'll bring back some of their burgers to Lynn and we've never been here before so she wanted me to come here and grab some food. The reason I'm actually waiting here instead of at home is because right after we eat at this restaurant, we're going to be going to Corgi Con, which is this Welsh Corgi kind of get together in the Richmond of San Francisco. So we'll be seeing what that is like. I don't know what to expect, never been to it before, but it's just another one of those free events that happen here in the city. And uh, I'm looking forward to it. So I'll check back in here once we get some uh, food going. All right, cool. All right, so food is here. Oh, God. So Burgers and fries. We're actually picking up some business now, but yeah, everything looks good. Um, they're probably prepping Lynn stuff as well, so uh, I guess I'll just go ahead and eat first. But they do have the fries that I like, and I mean, I got a cheeseburger. I don't think you want to miss that. Or do a little cheeseburger. Right. So I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy this and check back in in a moment. Alright, cool. Alright. And so now we've made it back to where my sister works and just waiting for her to get off. She's off in about I think five minutes here, so um, we'll see what happens. The burger was amazing. Um, totally recommend that little burger joint right outside of Japantown. Um, the food that I got for takeaway is uh, smelling awesome here in the car. Um, like I said, it's pretty hard to mess up a burger, so I'm pretty happy that they didn't. Um, but after this, we'll be going to CorgiCon, I believe. And then I think we're going to go see a movie after that. But I don't know what I'll do for that, uh, for this little vlog thing. But um, I forgot to mention just now that I did get a uh, pineapple shake um, from the place. And yeah, it's amazing. Um, brilliant idea. Love that. Um, I was really in debate between that and a coffee shake because I haven't had a cup of coffee yet. And admittedly, having a burger in the morning is kind of hard, but <laughs> anyhow, yeah, we will uh, check in in a moment here. All right, cool. So I am here at CorgiCon. Woo, these steps are steep. And. I found this event on Facebook and it's here at Ocean Beach in San Francisco and I came here because I wanted to see a bunch of adorable dogs and <laughs> so far it seems like it's pretty crowded with a lot of different people. Now we're here at 1 o'clock, it goes on until 2 but it started at 10 so that's why it's from 10 to 2. But there's a lot of different corgi mixes so far that I've seen and we were super lucky with parking um, We were able to get one pretty much right on Ocean Beach <gasps> Oh, look at these big mixes Time to go pet them ask. Rule number one for dog etiquette, always ask Don't just go up to a dog and that May I pet your dog? Yeah, of course, they're very good. <laughs> Hi! How are you? You're so cute. You're so cute. <laughs> You're such an adorable pup. 
So as you can see, there's a lot of different mixes, different breeds, or not breeds, but like mixes of corgis. And they're all super friendly and just chilling. I'm sure a lot of them are tired since we're at the tail end of the con, but we saw a lot of people walking away with really big like corgi pillows and um, just like paraphernalia, I guess. And so I guess people are selling stuff here and I, someone said that they're having adoptions as well. So I think that they're setting up to have, you know, people adopt dogs, which I think if I were to adopt a corgi, which I do plan on doing in my lifetime, I'd probably do it here. <laughs> but that's about it. All right. And so we have finished our day here at Corgi Pond. We're at Ocean Beach, San Francisco, and there were a ton of people here. It was pretty amazing, it was packed, and there were a ton of corgis and booths and people, just dog owners in general, dog lovers, I would say. And it was a real good time. There was just, you know, plenty of fluff everywhere. It was uh, really comfy and easy to kind of just go and um, pet some great looking dogs. They're all cute and everybody was having a good time. Um, Lynn got plenty of footage of her messing around with a ton of different dogs. They had corgis and other other dogs as well of all ages just um old and young so to say and there are some really cute puppies and there was a lot of cute dogs that were like dressed up in costume so yeah it was great and it was another really nice day at the beach um you know kind of sucks that california water is too cold to actually kind of do anything in um unless you're surfing with a wetsuit it's <laughs> interesting and it was a real good time all right now we're off to the movies so um i might get a little more in japantown other than that this might be it all right and i'll check back in hopefully <laughs>